Hey guys, Tech Mentor with the video for you guys. In today's video, I want to show you how to find your downloaded files, PDFs, documents, whatever you have downloaded, whether from the internet or your email where it's stored on your iPhone. So if you went and you maybe have downloaded something from the internet and automatically downloads to your phone, now there's a couple places it could be have gone. And the first place to check is on your iPhone is the Files app, which is again a default app on your iPhone to manage files. So go ahead and open that up. And once you open up, you might be in any of these screens here, depending on how much you use the app. So on the recent one, we'll tell you recent files that have been added to the files app that will show up here. Now, if you don't see something right there, you can also browse to the browse folder right here and then click on that browse option. And there's different locations files usually land in when you download it. You'll see an option for favorites under a downloads here that you can see here if I click on it. I will see the option for any downloaded files, which will be here if it's a PDF or a Word document that was downloaded from the internet, it will be right there for you. And again, if you can't find it, another thing you can do is if you remember the name of the files, you can also search for it or just search for PDF, right? So any PDF document will show up here or if it's a Word doc, right? You can put Word or doc here for Word doc and it will show you anything that's named under a Word document and it will show up here as well. Now another place to check for downloaded fo files or even photos might be the actual photos that's itself. So go to your photos app and then once you're there you should be able to go to albums and then under recently added it will show up here and this is if it is a photo that was downloaded most likely in a photo format like a uh, JPEG or uh, any of those formats will be here. So that's how you find downloaded files or on your iPhone. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider hitting that like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.